Hi, my name is Frank Schaefer. As well as being a writer of such books as Why I'm an Atheist Who Believes in God, I'm also a painter. And when Donald Trump was elected in 2016, of course, I put some of my outrage into my work. For instance, in this painting of Pinocchio's falling from the sky, uh, talking about his lies and the absurdity with rubber ducks and the infantile kind of attitude he has, and then this painting of more Pinocchios. And then another painting over here of uh, Trump's gold card in a martini glass and the kind of wreckage he would leave in my studio if he had a chance because he hates artists and creative people who stand against his ideas. But today I want to just make an open letter <laughs> to my artist friends. By the way, that's my dog. Uh, zip in the background. If you hear him barking, he wants to come into the studio. Um, put him out for a little bit. He had to, to uh, go to the bathroom. Now he wants to get back in. But anyway, today, this is a kind of an open letter to my creative friends. Look, in the 1980s and 1990s, the creative community made being gay and trans and lesbian and even gay marriage okay with millions of American people who regarded themselves as even conservative. And we changed how people felt about that. And now friends of mine are, are married who are gay and they not only feel okay about themselves, but most other people, even family members who are evangelicals kind of feel better about that. Now we have a new task. The federal judiciary has been taken over not only by Donald Trump, but the Federalist Society that have been feeding him judge candidates for posts all over the country in circuit courts and federal courts all over the place to stack it with far right wing people in favor of theocracy and imposing evangelical Christianity on the rest of us. This is the real legacy of the Republican Party that has like lick spittle enablers gone along with Trump holding their nose at his outlandishness. Why? Because they wanted to get this. They wanted to get the list that the evangelical white right has given them through the Federalist Society and it's worked. Judge Kavanaugh is just the tip of the iceberg. The real story here is a coup against the federal judiciary of being an independent branch of government. It is our job now to delegitimize them, to make them not okay, to parody them at every opportunity possible, whether it's in Saturday Night Live or anything else, to understand that they are simply now shills of a far-right Republican coup against the American people, a minority of white oligarchs imposing their will for billionaires and for others who have nothing to do with most of us Americans. So my fellow artist friends, hear me. Dedicate yourselves and your work in the next 10, 15, 20 years, however long it takes, to delegitimize the federal bench. It is now the property of the far right of the Republican Party. They are against women, they are against people of color, they are against immigrants, they are against gay people. They are against everybody but billionaires and right-wing ideologues and crazy white evangelicals who interpret religious freedom as imposing their will on us. Stand against them, mock them. Do what I try to do in this painting of Pinocchio dolls falling from the, from the sky to represent who Donald Trump is. Find your own way to do this. My name is Frank Schaefer.